hey, good morning, good morning, good morning. Stocks go up, stocks go down. Then we see, then we see, then we see. We're going to start today with a little story. A little story because this story applies to lots of people. And this is why people fail. Okay? And got a message yesterday. I didn't get a message, actually. This was just posted on Twitter. It says, oh, got beat up. Okay. So first of all, like I always tell you, you can only get beat up if you lie to yourself. Okay. But let's take this story a little bit farther. Okay. Let's take it a little bit farther. Let's say you had 10 grand. And let's say you bought 10 NVIDIA. And you bought them at 50 cents, way up there, right? And you ripped them 50 cents to $15. So you made 15 grand, okay? And then you said, Jesus, I'm going to do another trade. But instead of for 500, I'm going to do 1,000. And then you hit a Vago. And a Vago rips 100 points, and you sell it, and you make 40 grand. So now you're up like 55 grand. And then you start hitting Tesla, and you're hitting Snow, and you're hitting Lamb Research, and you're hitting everything. And you're up at 100 grand. You took 10 grand to 100 grand. Okay? And then this week happens. And let's say you're in with about 10 grand, which is pretty high. You shouldn't be in with 10 grand, but you're in with 10 grand. Because you're ready to keep going. You're going to make a million dollars. Uh, hold on a sec. I did start this right. <laughs> hold on a second. Uh, I believe you. So you guys, you can hear me, right? I mean, don't want to tell this story. Nobody's listening. Okay, just say yes. Say yes. Come on. Type. Somebody type. Okay, good. Okay. So you're at 100 grand, and you put in 10. So worst case, the whole week goes to shit. You're at 90 grand from 10. You've had an insane run in one month. Okay, but then you're like, because yesterday I literally, guys, you can't imagine, I literally got 50 messages nonstop of, can I buy Tesla? Can I buy Microsoft? Can I buy SMCI? Can I buy Adobe? Et cetera, et cetera. And I, and every one of them, I reply the exact same way. I say, up to you, but I'm not doing anything. I'm chilling. I told everybody I'm chilling. I'm not doing anything. And you buy some puts. Okay. So you buy two grand worth of puts. You're going to do that. So you're only hedging 10 grand. Right? Okay. So, and then things start going lower. And Tesla's way down. And some way, you, you say, well, not me, not me, but somebody says, I'm up 90 grand. I'm only down 10. I'm going to go buy 200 Tesla for next week. The 300s. $3. So you put in a $60,000 trade. And this morning, you're sending a message Oh my God, I'm going to get slaughtered. I'm like, same reaction. You get the exact same. I don't even have these on cut and paste. I, I, I type them. You can only get slaughtered if you lie to yourself. So you're going to lose 60 grand and the 10. So that's 70 grand. 70 grand. And you're, you're up from 10. So you're still going to be up 30. 10 to 30, is that okay? I'm absolutely positive that that's not going to be okay with this guy. And he will buy more calls because that's what people do. And within a week or two, he will be under his initial 10 grand. When Sam says, chill, 
There's nothing to do. I looked at literally 500 different options yesterday. And I didn't see one option where you would have made a decent amount of money. If you would have bought Microsoft puts, you'd have taken them from 50 cents to 60 cents. If you bought Microsoft calls, you took them from 50 cents to 30 cents. If you bought UPSD calls, you took them 12, 20 cents to 12 cents. If you bought e, UPSD puts, you took them from one to 120. There wasn't no money to be made in anything, in anything. But if you made a hundred grand, I fully understand you need to make a million today. You need to take that hundred grand to make it a million today. It can't be tomorrow. It can't be next week. It can't be in two weeks when the market's really good again. You have to do it today. Guys, what's wrong with people? If you send me nonstop messages, can I buy this? Can I buy this? Can I buy The market since Tuesday opens down every day. And it accelerates down, it goes down 10 or 20 or 30, and then it pops 20, and nothing else moves either way. Adobe opens at 494 on a monster upgrade, goes down 20. Tesla hits 280, it's at 250, it's down 30. NVIDIA was at 4, 440 yesterday, it's at 4, it was at 420 yesterday. Now it's popping back up. Avago can't go up $5, let alone the premium that he wants for $50. Guys, it's a sign of chill and do nothing. Chill and do nothing. Don't make up stuff thinking Tesla's going to release chips and this, this, and this. Tesla ain't going to release no chips. There's no support. Guys, you don't understand. Tesla can't release chips with no support. Zero chance. If you sell, if Nvidia sells a chip to somebody and it doesn't work, they're going to sue the shit out of Nvidia. Elon not going to do that. He doesn't have five thousand employees to do that. Okay. Chill and wait. Yesterday, things that didn't make sense. Dear. So they're going to keep raising rates till they get a recession. Well, in a recession, the dear CEO told you, the stock was at 394, that with the recession, we're going to guide down. The stock goes to 350. And dear goes up 10 yesterday on a possible recession. Doesn't make any sense. Things have to make sense, okay? It's okay to chill. If you made $3 million, why not put in 100000 say, what's that, 1, 3%, 3%, 3%, and just chill. If you made 100000 you put in three grand and chill. Just relax, guys, relax, 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 wait. There's nothing to be done on either side. Now you can play NVIDIA up and NVIDIA down. And we got NVIDIA up because if they guide up, this thing is at 500. If they don't guide, it's probably back to 400. So we probably buy some puts just in case. We bought some SPX puts, but we don't have much to hedge. We're just kind of chilling. The last move always fails. Tesla may go up 10 weeks in a row, but in the 11th week, it will fail. Maybe 12th week, 13th week. What does that mean? That means if you take one grand to 100 grand and you're buying every week, at some point, you're going to get whacked. So why, why, if, you, if, if you're betting $500 trades and $1,000 trade, and you, you take it to a hundred thousand dollars. Why are you doing a fifty thousand dollar trade? 
Really? I mean, why not just chill? It's okay. It's okay. SMCI has to pop if NVIDIA is going to pop. Now, when? I don't know. But it's down $60. It's down $60. It can go down another 50 And when it turns, it's going to go up 100 so do you want to have money left when it goes up 100? Or do you want to be whacked, completely destroyed because you want to do 50 and 60,000 dollar trade because you have to make that million today and not tomorrow? Really? Really, 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 really. When does it start back up? I don't know. But here's what I know for today. If Nvidia doesn't say anything good, and they keep selling, the selling will accelerate. And if it accelerates, 4,300 comes, and if that breaks, 4,260. Now, does it accelerate? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just telling you. I don't know. Maybe it does. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe we pop. And when we pop, I'll be back in there buying big. Right now, we're just chilling. Learn to chill. Guys, be happy. It amazes me the amount of people that take five and ten grand, the people that are up 100, 200, 300, 400, 800 grand, they're not happy. How are you not happy? Oh, well, I, I, I never had more than 50,000 in my name ever, but now I have 100. So I'll do a 50,000 trade. I, I mean, I don't even know what to say. The whole concept. I mean, watch the, my pin video every day. If that's you, watch it every day. If, if you traded and you've made a ridiculous amount of money, why are you 10xing your bet? You do that when the market is going up or down nonstop. We're not going down nonstop. We're going down 20 a day. That's not 100 a day. We're not going up 50 a day. So just chill. Adobe is down 50 points. They're all down 50 points. Let it drop. Okay? That's the rant. Okay. Today, Microsoft. Microsoft is positive. That hasn't happened in, in five days. But a two-point move is not enough. Microsoft needs to hit 340 today to be real. If it's 340, boom, Sam's it. NVIDIA, down four. They're going to report something. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe they don't say anything. If they don't say anything, that would be bad. If it's good and they guide up, boom, everything rips and we're in huge on everything, but not till. Wait, relax, breathe. AI reports uh, a meeting today too. Do they guide up? Let me tell you, if AI doesn't guide up double, they're going to get slammed. doesn't matter what NVIDIA says. Okay? Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay? Uh, MDB has a meeting too today. Okay, so that's what's going on. So just chill. Just wait. There's nothing to do. You buy some puts because just in case the market drops 30 or 40, it collapses, you're good. Outside of that, you're just chilling. You're just relaxing. Say, hey, I'm good with everything. Microsoft's starting to move. If Microsoft pops, then everything pops. And then we're right back into everything. And Tesla goes positive and it's back to 280 tomorrow. But if NVIDIA doesn't say anything good and the market reverses back lower and Microsoft breaks 333 at open where it pops too and then drops negative, kind of like Adobe, then we're going down today and tomorrow until we get the next real set of news that takes us up. So you have to wait and chill, have to wait and chill, 
and have to wait and chill. I mean, I'm telling you, if you post, I got whacked, what's that tell me? It tells every single person in the world that you lie to yourself. Don't lie to yourself. Expect it to go to zero. If you made a hundred grand doing five hundred dollar trades, why not do it again? Move eighty percent of that money out and do it again. And you'll do great. Okay? So that's what's going on today. Okay, let's get going. Good morning, good morning, everybody. Six twenty two. Oh, listen to this again if this is you. There's several people doing stuff like this. Okay? Interesting, interesting. Okay, so SPX. SPX was down 12, and now it's down 6, okay? 4352, 4331, 4300 needs 4400 to be better. And what's going to make it go to 4400? If NVIDIA is good, it will rip everything up. Now, I think NVIDIA is going to be good. There's a rumor if they're doing 16 billion. But here's the thing. Here's the thing, guys. If NVIDIA, there was, they made $7 billion last year in revenue, in the last month, in, uh, last quarter, revenue. They guided to 11. There's a rumor that the next quarter is going to be 16. That's massive. If that's true, it's a 550. Okay? But here's the thing. Lots of people still think this is a one-quarter wonder. That means it's up. Four billion this quarter, next quarter goes back to nine. Well, that would be a negative. That means your chip sold for one quarter and that's it. That would take everything down. So they need to guide for the year. I understand they're not going to guide for the thir third quarter now. Zero chance. They won't do that. But they could guide for the year. So if you add 11 billion to seven, that's 18. Right? If it's really 16, that's 34. So then you have one more quarter of, say, 14 or 15, and, you, and, and you're at 50. So if they would guide to 50, that would be massive. But that would also say they have enough orders for a full year. Now, if they don't guide, that means they're not sure. If they don't guide, that means they're not really sure what's going to happen with anything. Now, they don't need to guide. And it will probably do okay. Maybe it drops 15 or 20, but it'll do okay. But it will hurt all the other stuff. So you have to chill and wait. Okay? Avago. Can't get out of its own way. Does this get back to 810 now? Okay? 888 is now a beast number. 888 is a beast number. So wait, wait, wait. NVIDIA. 452, 471, underneath, if it breaks 400, is 371. Land research, going lower, going lower. 572 down, 632 up. CMG, does it break? If this takes out 2100 today, it can go to 2140. UPSD, this hits 39 twice and drops 8. So just wait and chill. Now, if you like UPSD and you believe in it, the 40 calls for September are a great play right now. Way out there. Relax, relax, relax. Snowman. We're in these 200s for earnings. Or not earnings, for the conference next week. With Jeff's. But it will move on NVIDIA today, one way or the other. So chill and wait again. Adobe. Very straightforward. If and when it breaks 521 now. It will go nuts. It's not there yet. MDB, going down. Do they guide up today? Don't know. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Netflix, this hits 440. We had three layers of this, and we're not back in. But over the last two days, I've had over 10 messages from people, can I buy Netflix? And Sam, what does Sam say when you ask me, can I buy something? Up to you. I'm not in. Chill. Up to you. So that's, you get the standard answer. You, I've never, ever told anybody to buy anything, ever, ever, ever. So chill. Relax. Win. Basing, 108, 
12, AI, if they don't guide way up, if they tell you something like, in two years we're going to make a dollar, I mean, this stock is going to implode, okay? They, so, so the things that people say, the FedEx guy, we're going to cut $4 billion in expenditures, and then doesn't beat. You're going to cut $4 billion, you're laying off people, and you can't beat. Wow. AI at earnings. This is the greatest environment I've ever seen in any business ever. I've never seen more demand in anything ever. Doesn't guide up. Explain that to me. Right? SMCI. They make the computers. If and when this pops 10, it will be ready. Till then, maybe it drops 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Who knows? NOW. Slowly working lower, 572 next. Shopalicious under six under sixty or over sixty six. Microsoft has to lead. It's not leading, has to lead. Three forty minimum. Wait, wait, wait. Underneath three twenty one possible. Amazon. No man's land. Why is anybody buying Amazon? Doesn't move. Deer. So you can't have it both ways. If you're going to have a recession, deer is going to get whacked to 360. If you're not going to get a recession, deer is going to go up to 442. Tesla, huge downgrade, 249, 241, needs over 272 to be better. So now Tesla had this run for three weeks. So wait. We're not in any Tesla for next week. No reason to get Tesla for next week. You don't know what's going to happen yet. Just relax. Just relax. Breathe. Okay, comments, questions. Just looks bad. What are the levels? So all of the banks, everybody's saying the banks are still in bad shape, and if they raise, they're going to get worse. Very possible. Now, GS, it's just garbage. They can't make money. they got guys telling you what the market's going to do, and they're on the wrong side. All the time, all the time. Two thirty one, two uh, three three thirty one. Ah, up three thirty one, up three thirty nine. Underneath three twenty one, three sixty. Okay, that's what we know. That's what we know. Okay, guys, watch the video. Don't lie to yourself. Go slow. If so many people made so much money, so just relax. Breathe. Take the wife out every day. Buy a different diamond every day. Spend ten grand a day on her. That's okay. Everybody have a great trade day, Sanchez.